Managing blood glucose levels requires more than just a crash course diet. Implementing certain lifestyle changes can help you to keep your blood sugar levels manageable in the long term. The following suggestions will get you on the right track. 1. Managing carbs. Carbohydrates are a good part of a healthy diet. When we eat carbs, they're broken down into sugars by insulin produced in our bodies. However, a health problem that inhibits the production of insulin or its function, such as type 2 diabetes, can get in the way of dealing with the excess sugar. Eating too many carbs can also result in too much sugar in our bodies. Foods like bread and potatoes are high in carbohydrates. While these foods have their place in a healthy diet, you might want to consider cutting down on high-carb foods and introducing more low-carb alternatives. 2. Regular Exercise Exercise is good for our bodies in many, many ways. It improves alertness, boosts heart health, keeps us physically fit, and releases serotonin in our brains. However, exercise also improves insulin sensitivity. Greater insulin sensitivity means that your cells can better absorb and use the excess sugar in your body, thus can help lower blood sugar naturally. Insulin resistance, on the other hand, is what can cause high blood glucose in the first place. If you're not used to a high level of exercise, start slowly and build up gradually. A brisk walk, hiking, or even dancing can help to get your blood pumping. 3. Proper Hydration Whether you're suffering from high blood sugar levels or not, it's crucial to stay properly hydrated. Drinking plenty of water helps to flush out toxins and excess sugars from the body via the kidneys. It also rehydrates the blood and aids digestion. However, be warned, don't use sugary beverages to hydrate. Sodas or some fruit juices contain high levels of sugar. Alcoholic beverages such as beer also contain sugar. Instead of refreshing your body and keeping you hydrated, sugary drinks can actually raise your glucose levels. 4. Eating a high-fiber diet Blood sugar levels can rise steeply right after we eat a meal. Fiber in our diet can help to slow the absorption of sugars and the digestion of carbs. Why is this helpful? A slower breakdown process allows the body to absorb sugars gradually, giving your metabolism time to work. A high fiber diet also makes you feel fuller for longer, reducing the chance of snacking later on. This prevents you from unintentionally overloading your body with carbs and sugars and can help to maintain a healthy body weight. Fiber can be found in fruits, vegetables, legumes, and more. Check out the glycemic index of your favorite foods if you need any extra guidance. The glycemic index gives you a clearer idea of how much an impact certain foods will have on your blood sugar. 5. Monitor Stress Levels Our lives tend to be more and more stressful nowadays, packed with activities and responsibilities. However, stress can cause blood sugar levels to rise. This is because our bodies release certain hormones when we're under duress, like cortisol. These hormones inhibit proper blood glucose management, leading to sharply rising glucose levels. 6. Eat a balanced diet. Foods with plenty of fiber, protein, and other vitamins and minerals are good for maintaining balanced blood glucose. People with diabetes should beware of eating too much fruit along with fruit juices. These products contain natural sugars, and some fruit juices are very high in sugars. Junk food or processed foods can be particularly high in sugar. Your body tries to absorb all of this excess sugar quickly, causing your blood glucose levels to rise. 7. Focus on sleep quality Would you think that sleep can affect your blood sugar levels? Well, it certainly can. In fact, the quality and quantity of your sleep will affect more areas of your health and well-being. Poor sleep can lead to higher blood glucose levels and can decrease insulin sensitivity. A lack of sleep can lead to our bodies producing too much of certain hormones, such as cortisol. Too much of this hormone can negatively impact blood sugar. Poor sleep can cause appetite fluctuations and cravings the next day, you might find yourself hungrier than usual or craving some sugary snack or junk food. Giving in to these cravings is all too easy and can lead to a dangerous spike in your blood sugar levels. 8. Weight Monitoring Being overweight can put a person at a greater risk of certain diseases, including type 2 diabetes. This can bring a whole host of other problems, including insulin resistance. 
Insulin resistance means that the body struggles to absorb sugar, resulting in rocketing blood sugar. Eating a healthy diet and exercising regularly can go a long way to maintaining a healthy weight. If you're having issues with losing weight, why not meet up with a doctor or a nutritionist to discuss an action plan? Remember, healthy weight loss takes time. In fact, the recommended sustainable weight loss rate is only 1 to 3 pounds a week. Taking action may take time, but losing weight too quickly can be every bit as unhealthy as gaining it. Let's take a look at some foods which can be especially helpful to regulate blood sugar levels. What we eat has a direct impact on our blood sugar levels. Certain foods are better than most for blood sugar lowering. These foods can help to improve insulin sensitivity, providing us with the vitamins, minerals, and energy that we need without overloading our bodies with junk and toxins. 1. Dark Green Leafy Vegetables This includes spinach, kale, known as a superfood for good reason, and broccoli, all of which are excellent diet additions. This is because broccoli in particular contains sulforaphane, a product that has blood sugar reducing properties. Sulforaphane can even help to enhance insulin sensitivity, enhancing sugar absorption in the body. Kale also contains antioxidants, which can also boost insulin sensitivity in the body. In fact, cruciferous vegetables are known to help reduce a person's chances of developing type 2 diabetes. 2. Nuts for most of us, nuts and nut butter are already a delicious snack to enjoy between meals. Nuts, like peanuts and almonds, can help to reduce blood sugar levels, especially when eaten between meals. Nuts are filling and can help discourage further snacking. A low-carb diet can lead to feelings of hunger and particular cravings, making a handful of nuts the perfect snack. 3. Pumpkin Pumpkin and pumpkin seeds are a great source of fiber as well as being packed with antioxidants. In fact, pumpkin is used as a traditional diabetic remedy in some cultures. Pumpkin contains a carb known as polysaccharides. This carbohydrate is known for its power to regulate blood sugar in the body. 4. Beans and Lentils Nutrients such as magnesium, protein, and fiber all work to reduce blood sugar levels. Fortunately, beans and lentils are rich in these nutrients. For instance, adding lentils or chickpeas to a meal can significantly reduce post-meal blood sugar. The wide variety of beans and lentils available mean that it's easy to find something to work into a simple meal. 5. Seafood Seafood is full of proteins, nutrients, and antioxidants. As part of a healthy, balanced diet, fatty fish and seafood can also help to balance blood sugar levels. Fatty fish, when consumed in moderation, may even be more beneficial to blood sugar than lean fish. Fatty fish include salmon and sardines. 6. Oats Soluble fiber is found in oats and oat bran, meaning that your breakfast porridge could be the healthiest start possible to your day. 7. Citrus Some fruits such as watermelon or pineapple can actually raise blood sugar levels due to their natural sugar content. Citrus fruits like oranges and grapefruit contain plenty of fiber, this is a plant compound known for its anti-diabetic properties. Regularly eating citrus fruits can help to reduce your risk of developing type 2 diabetes as well as improving insulin sensitivity. 8. Eggs Last but certainly not least, we have the Mighty Egg. Eggs are a powerful addition to any diet, providing protein, vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants. Tasty and versatile, there's a lot you can do with an egg. Eggs may also help to reduce blood glucose levels. Some studies suggest that eating eggs could help to lower a person's chance of developing type 2 diabetes in later life. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to give this video the thumbs up. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy our next video on 10 foods that are worse than sugar. Thanks for watching and bye for now.